Today's Science is a carefully curated database that features thousands of articles, conversational interviews, and resources on current scientific research. It bridges the gap between science taught in the classroom and real-world discoveries, providing in-depth coverage of important advances in all the science disciplines. Let's take a quick tour. There are two ways to use this database. One is to browse, and the other is to search. Let's look at browse first. The most recent articles appear on the home page. You'll see a featured article at the top of the page, followed by a list of monthly articles organized alphabetically. For additional articles in previous months, click on More Articles at the bottom of the page. Another way to browse is through the Topic Index, accessible on the front page in the top navigation bar above the featured article. By clicking on the Topic Index, you can see the 12 subject areas covered by today's science and the several hundred subtopics also called out. If you click on any one of these, say, Genetics under Biology, you will see a list of chronological articles, newest to oldest, accompanied by a brief excerpt from the article. On the right rail is a list of related topics. Let's open an article. As you see, every article is based on a peer-reviewed scientific journal article with a direct link to the journal. Each article begins by placing the research in context with the facts you need to know, followed by a description of the scientific methodology used by the researchers. The database features thousands of current science articles, with new ones being added daily. Each article contains hyperlinked teaching tools for the students. Most important is the underlined embedded glossary that defines key terms used in the article enhancing the student's scientific literacy. Other embedded links include encyclopedia descriptions and today's science-related articles. These links are both marked in blue in the story text. Each article also includes extensive images, photographs, diagrams, charts, graphs, illustrations, and maps that illustrate and enhance the narrative of the article. To enhance critical thinking and research skills, each article concludes with discussion questions, links to journal abstracts and articles, and the bibliography and keywords to use for additional research. Below the keywords is the citation information for MLA, APA, and the Chicago Manual of Style. To provide additional context, factual background, and additional learning tools, all articles contain related content on the right rail. These always include links to other related stories and sometimes contain links to interviews with scientists, crossword puzzles, and cartoons. All the links contain brief descriptions of the content. Let's go back to the front page for a closer look at the related content. Let's start with our primary source material, Conversations with Scientists, a series of exclusive interviews with scientists whose research we have covered in our articles. In this section, they tell us in their own words what it means for them to be scientists. Each interview is accompanied by a brief biography, images, and embedded glossary, encyclopedia, and appropriate article links. On the right rail is the link back to the original article or articles, which in turn links back to the scientist's interview, both from the name inside the article marked in blue and from the right rail. Let's return to the home page to take a closer look at the unique support materials in today's science. To improve a student's science vocabulary, we have created custom interactive and printed crossword puzzles based on glossary items within the article. You can view a list of crosswords by topic or select a crossword from under the related content in a specific article. To support critical thinking skills in students, Today's science has put together cartoons on relevant issues accompanied by analytical questions arranged by topic and title. Under Related Articles are all the articles containing a link to this group of cartoons. The glossary, with more than 9,000 science definitions, can be searched independently as well as accessed inside the articles. And finally, The Year in Science, a comprehensive summary from 2005 to 2019 of each year's most important scientific research, with embedded links to every article cited, along with pop-up glossary definitions and encyclopedia links, plus explanatory images, discussion questions, bibliography, 
and keywords. Let's return to the home page to take a quick look at another resource for student research, the research topics. There are 38 research topics covering a wide range of current issues of scientific interest, including such topics as dinosaurs, evolution, genetics, global warming, medicine, technology, and space. Each research topic has a brief explanation of the topic, followed by a chronological list of the articles, from newest to oldest. On the right rail is a list of all 38 research topics with hyperlinks. Let's return to the home page again to look at the video news briefs on the top right, a collection of fun fact science news videos from Inside Science. You can choose a video from a wide range of topics listed alphabetically by title under any of the 12 subject areas, from astronomy to technology. Let's look at a three-minute video under biology called Pollution and the Scent of a Flower, accompanied by a brief description and a full transcript. The second way to use this database to find the content you're looking for is by search. The search bar appears on every page. Let's type a word or phrase, COVID-19, and you can see the many articles on this subject. You can narrow your search results by subject, article type, and or date by checking selected items on the left rail. You can also use the advanced search to find full article or title search results as well. Today's science also features many other resources, including curriculum tools to show students how to analyze editorial cartoons and primary sources, avoid plagiarism, evaluate online sources, create a science fair project, solve crossword puzzles, and write a research paper. Today's science articles are based on hundreds of sources. You can find a list under Sources at the bottom of the home page. Every research article is based on a scientific paper or papers published in one of the more than 450 peer-reviewed journals listed. In addition, the journals are supplemented by authoritative sources from magazines, newspapers, and websites, groups and institutions, and government agencies and organizations. So that's the quick tour. I hope you'll look around on your own. We think you'll find everything you need to understand the latest scientific issues, learn about science methodology and the scientists behind the research, and prepare for scientific discussions, research papers, or science fair projects. If you'd like to speak to someone about our flexible subscription plans, please contact us. We'd love to hear from you.